All right, well, I heard from some people that yesterday's digits was interesting and I didn't get a chance to look at it. So I've jumped in the time machine and I'm gonna do yesterday's digits puzzle. And then I'm gonna come back to the present and do today's digits puzzle as well. Why not? So we'll do 10 different digits. Well, two days worth, but there's five on each. Anyways, this is the math puzzle where you're just trying to use the numbers given to make the, the number at the top of the thing here. So it's about all we need to know. So 81, um, I mean, four times two, is eight times 10 is 80 plus one, 81. There we go, that's an easy one. Next puzzle, 106. So, uh, I mean, 10 times 10 is 100, and then two times three is six, so is there a good way to get another 10 to multiply by the 10? I don't think there is. We can also do nine times 11 to get 99. Oh, and then add seven, yeah. There we go, 99 plus seven, 106. Moving right along. All right, well, 238, so 25 times uh, 11, five plus six is 11. 25 times 11 would be, uh, no, that'd be too many, wouldn't it? 25 times eight would be 200. Well, 25 times 11 could still work. It would be 275, but we'd have to subtract 37. And... 27 and 8. No, we can't quite get there. So, but 25 times 8 is 200, and then we would need 38. Uh, oh, we can. So, 6 times 8 is 48, minus 9 is 39. We'd need 38. So, that doesn't quite work. So, it feels like we're going to have to multiply 25 times something. Uh, times, times what? Times nine, six plus three is nine. So 25 times nine would be 225. And then 13, yeah, yeah, yeah. So six, I should have thought of that from the start, actually. Nine times 25 is 225. And then we need to add 13. Eight plus five is 13. We can add that to the 225. There we go, 238, all right. All right, 384. So, I mean, probably gonna have to multiply the 15 times something. 15 times 20 would be 300. So, uh, we can do, I mean, so six times four is 24. So 15 times 24 would be 360. And then we would need to add 24. Ooh, so, so 16 times, hmm. Right, which means, so if 15 times, so let's, let's, here, let me, let me show you what I'm thinking. 24 times 15 is 360, which means we're 24 short. So if we can do 16 times 24, which can be nine minus eight, which is one, plus 15 is 16, 16 times 24 is gonna give us 384. There we go. All right, 413, so 20 times 23 is 460. So then we would need to subtract 47. Is there a good way to get to 47? Uh, 11 and 19 is 30. So not 20 times 23. What if we do, um, I mean 20 times 25 is 500, which is getting farther away. What about 25, no. What about 20 times 19? That gets us to 380. And then we need to add 33. Oh, we can do 23 plus 11 is 34. I want 33. 25 plus 8 is 33. Huh, 3 times 11 is 33, but there's not a good way to get a 3, I don't think. Oh yeah, there is, yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, we can do this. So 25 minus 23 is 2. 5 minus 2 is 3. 3 times 11 is 33, 380, plus 33, it's 413. There we go, all right, so that was yesterday's digits. Now I'm gonna jump on my time machine and skip back to present day. 
It's always, it's always a little bit discombobulating when you jump in the time machine, but we're back to present day, so now we're looking at today's digits puzzle. Okay. So, 77. Well, 25 times 3 is 75. And then we just add 2, and we have 77. Okay. Always starts off easy, and the last couple are usually the hardest ones, but 175. Well, 15 times, uh... What, 11 is 165. Um, we can do 9 plus 2 to get 11. 15 times 11 would be 165. And then we'd have to add 10, yeah. So 9 plus 2 is 11 times 15 is 165. And then 3 plus 7 is 10. And 10 plus 165 is 175. There we go. Next one. Um, so... Let's see, 25 times 10 is 250. 25 times 11 is 275. Then we would need to add 12, which we can easily do, because five plus seven is 12. 12 plus 275, 287. There we go. All right, number four, 396. So my first thought is to do like 20 times, uh, ooh, 20 times 20 is 400. So we need another uh, yeah, 11 plus 6 plus 3 is 20. 20 times 20 is 400. 400 minus 4, 396. All right, and on to the last one. Mm, well, 20 times 20 is 400. So 20 times 19 is 380. And then we would need 34, which is just 23 plus 11. So 20 times 19... 380 plus 34, 414, there we go, all right, well, that was probably my fastest ever digits solve right there for today's, as, as far as all five of them together. Very cool, all right, so that was yesterday's digits and today's digits. Uh, let me know how these went for you, how'd you do with yesterday's, how'd you do with today's, which one did you think was the hardest? And did you do today's faster than you've done any of them before? I think that's the fastest I've done all five of them. There's usually one that I get stuck on, and I didn't really have any issues with any of them today, so maybe that time travel actually helped clear my mind. Usually I think it discombobulates me. Maybe it helps clear my mind. <laughs> Anyways, let me know how these puzzles went for you, and be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. Part of a water system that flows from right here at Lake Okeechobee in central Florida out to the Gulf of Mexico. The name Okeechobee. Okay, so not not Africa, but Northeast. Okay, so we're in the Middle East then, probably. Because it is pretty warm. Uh, oh, no, 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 it's not because the A is at the end. Uh, it's gonna be extra. Uh, oh, and Oxide, we would've had the X from Oxide. 